Welcome back. So in this lecture, you're going to learn how to create an Instagram custom audience. This is a super important thing to know how to do because sometimes doing your ads on Instagram is a better idea than doing them on Facebook simply because the platform is so different, right? So let's say that you're selling art or you're selling clothes or you're selling images. Well, to, to create ads for those products on an image-based platform, that's just fantastic, right? And since Facebook owns Instagram, they connect very easily and it's very easy to create a custom audience from Instagram. Let's dive in. So here we are again, we're getting really comfortable with this place, right? We're gonna go ahead and click on create audience, custom audience again, and now we're going to click on Instagram account. Then it says create an audience of people who visited or interacted with your Instagram po uh, profile, post or ads. You will need a professional account which can either be business or creator account, right? So in order to set up a business account, well, then I've added in a tutorial on just how to do that, right? So I'm going to put this in the resources so you can see how to add, set up a business account should you want to do that. It's very easy to do. This will be in the resources. So from here, things are very simple. Once again, include people who meet any or all. If we take any, it just needs to meet one of them. If we take all, it needs to meet every single factor, right? We're going to go with any. And then we're going to change to our usual, which is going to be Robin and Jesper because that is the Instagram that we have connected, right? R and J deals, we haven't connected our Instagram yet. But in order to do that, we need to go into our business manager and then go below where it says Instagram and then just connect the account. Super easy. And then go and turn it into a business account. Easy peasy, right? And then we have a couple of options. We can add in as a custom audience, everyone who engaged with your professional account, that would be well, literally everyone. Anyone who visited your professional uh, account's profile, people who engaged with any post or ad, people who sent a message to your professional account, or people who saved any post or ad, right? So these are all different levels of engagement. Uh, once again, just like in videos. So that means that if you want to go with a bigger list, you're going to go with everyone who is engaged with your account, right? But if you want to go with those people who are more engaged, but that's going to create a smaller list, you're going to want to go with people who engage with any post or people who sent a message to your account or people who saved any post or ad. For now, we're going to go with everyone who engaged with our account. And then we're going to go with in the past 365 days in the past year. And just like before, we can include more people and we can also exclude, but we're not going to play around with those we already did. And then we're just going to call this Instagram custom audience. There we go. And then we're going to click on create audience. And then we're done. It's that quick and that simple. Now, the only difference is that you need to have a professional account and that is either a creator Instagram account or a business account. And the easiest to set up is just to get your business account up and running. So I'm going to add in this tutorial. It's going to be in the resources. Click there in order to set it up and then go to your uh, business manager and just add in your Instagram profile and you'll be all set, right? But there's no point in doing this if you don't have a grown Instagram already with a lot of people who are engaging. So it's a very, very great way to get a custom audience from Instagram because Instagram is a very potent platform depending on what you're selling. It's image based and that means a certain type of people are there that means it's going to be perfect for certain products hope you learned a lot i hope you're enjoying this see you in the next lecture